Hi Libra! This is your weekly day by day tarot readings by M for the week starting 16th of March 2020. Right, so we're gonna draw now seven cards, one for each day of the week. Okay, let's start. Okay, Monday, two of cups. Tuesday, the magician. Three of Wands on Wednesday. Justice card. Your card. Your energy. Thursday. And then Ten of Wands. Friday. Knight of Swords. Saturday. And nine of swords Sunday, some fear there. Anyway, let's see. Nine of wands. Did I see somewhere nine of wands? No, it was ten of wands. Nine of swords. Lots of wands. This is nine of wands. Your energy influencing you this week. Do you see it? Well, it's all right. Nine of Wands is when you, I think you did have in either your uh, three cards uh, weekly. I had it with him. I published at the beginning of this week. Nine of Wands. I think, I think it was your energy. You know, nine and ten of Wands, you, you will be, you will uh, uh, drop this load. You will be finishing whatever you have started. Somewhere you something that you are busy with. You are uh, defending, negotiating. The nine of Wands is negotiation as well because I see two of Cups, the magician. They could be that you negotiating something heavily, you know, and and it maybe is lasting for too long now, or you doing something repeatedly, some some job over and over again, and you kind of feel that you are sick and tired of that anymore you will finish this is brave courageous warrior nine of ones you will finish whatever you started you will put an end to it but you are not enjoying it not anymore if you ever enjoyed whatever there was that you're doing you are not enjoying it anymore even if it's negotiation even if it's, uh, even if it's a big deal about something even um, no matter what making money doesn't matter You feel tired already, exhausted. Now Monday, Two of Cups. Let's pair it with lovely Nine of Cups. Just what you wanted. It's just what you wanted. If it's negotiation, it's going to be finished in your favor. It's going to be just lovely. That's what you wanted. The Magician on Tuesday. Oh, nice. Nine and <laughs> Nine of Pentacles. We have three nines in here. Three of Wands on on uh, uh, Wednesday with the Hierophant. Just this card. So your energy in here with Ace of Swords. Sure, decision. That's beautiful. Let's see this Ten of Wands. What it says. Friday, King of Pentacles. Very nice. Knight of Swords, Saturday. Four of Cups. And then Nine of Swords. Is that fourth nine? Well, we have all nines in here. <laughs> With Five of Swords. Now your Sunday is a bit tricky. Everything else seems so good. <laughs> So good. Temperance. It's for you, Libra, with your balancing justice card in here. I'm again doing it. I'm rushing and doing and explaining card which is on Thursday. <laughs> but anyway, I'm just gonna connect it. Uh, your influencing energy now. Balance, balance, balance. That's it. Whatever you do, you're waiting, you're doing it. You're waiting and you're doing it. You are not making problem. You're not complaining. You're standing firm. What needs to be done, it needs to be done. That's it. Balance, balance, balance. No complaints. 
lovely. It's so Libra, it's so much of Libra energy in there. Let's just finish the job, let's do what we need to do, let's do it right way. Everything will be just fine, balancing, smoothing it. Kind of, um, I really think that it's some sort of negotiation and it is kind of business in here. Anyway, let's start from the beginning. Monday, two of cups and nine of cups. Wish come true. <laughs> You wish come true. It's is that what you said when you uh, um, make this partnership, this harmonious relationship, this beautiful decision that you make. Two of cups, all of it, very healthy, very healthy. If it's health, maybe for some of you, it's good. It's just what you wanted. That you know, this card says it's just what I wanted on Monday. Lovely. That will make you happy. Feels like one, whatever it is. Uh, um, if it's your love partner, your spouse, your business partner, you yourself with some two ideas that you putting together in harmony, negotiation. It says, just what I want today. It's good, lovely. Now, Tuesday, with magician. In here and nine of pentacles. I love magician, one of my favorite. You know, it's all intelligent, all ideas I are they. You know, it's it cannot be better. It's perfect genius who understand everything and it can do understand that can do everything. You know, like you said, I understand everything. I can learn anything you bring in front of me and whatever business whatever relationship whatever partnership if it's negotiation i'll do it to perfection i can do it to perfection because i understand i can communicate because i am perfection i can do magic magician often often problem with my favorite <laughs> is that is not moving forward. It's stuck with, with intelligence, with the beautiful talks, with beautiful ideas, lacking movement. Uh, Sometimes nothing really happens because everything gets finished with all excitement of all brilliance in there. Brilliant idea, brilliant presentation, and then that's it, puff. But with Nine of Pentacles, now we take away that bad side of this card. You see what I'm saying? Now that side is taken away. You are definitely eager to move forward. On your own. You are here on your own. And you understand that you can really magically, like magically, do anything that is your way. And you're doing it. You're doing it. You're completing it. you uh, bringing abundance there like like magic like you know like magic wands works here for you maybe maybe i don't know um um tuesday um okay i'm not gonna say anything about gambling usually these two cards it can say it's magic money or something but i think it's just a hard work behind this <laughs> nine of pentacles nine of pentacles i really would never put into gambling um uh, Magician, yes, but nine of nine of nine of uh, pentacles is work. It is work. Successful, successful, um, high quality work, intelligence and everything is there. Everything in these two, in combination of nine of pentacles and and the magician, is work about uh, um, everything is everything is in there. It, it, it's intelligence, it's logic, it's uh, uh, brilliant work, um, um, success, all comes there with these two cards on Tuesday somehow for you, Libra. Everything is beautiful. Look at this and two of cups, nine of cups, wish come true. Now, Hierophant in this business, like you have started something uh, all the time again, negotiation for me. <laughs> Look at this. It is some sort of business. You expect some results. You expect somebody to come back to you about 
talks, negotiations, uh, um, something that you have started and initiated already, you expect something to come back to you. And the Hierophant in here says, yes, it's coming. It's coming. And it's coming right away. Be patient. It is here. It's coming. Almost there. The Hierophant says, everything is right in the right position everything is in the right way you did everything that you're supposed to do your boats are back uh, uh, the sea is calm everything is right everything is right for everybody you'll get your results now Thursday as I said already justice it's your energy, it's balancing energy. Could be low, but I think being here for you, Libra, I think you feeling so comfortable within yourself with these new ideas. You, this is, uh, um, these opportunities, this is something that is massive potential that you realize that you have in here. Massive potential. This is things happening in here. Again, I'm gonna say negotiation. <laughs> It's not whatever it is for you. But you realize on Thursday this massive potential that comes out of all of out of all of it. Out of that that magician is doing, out of these ideas that you have, this magician has brilliant ideas. This business that you started. Now work that you do on Friday, it seems it seems it burdens you, but you will manage. You will manage. You're not gonna. You're not gonna uh, uh, carry this forever. You're gonna drop this load. You are already there, and results. You feel. You feel really with this potential. You feel your results will come. This is a very solid uh, energy of King of Pentacles. That one. He says, work hard. Uh, save your money, go forward, move forward, and you will say, uh, um, be in the safe and stable position with money, with authority, with beautiful house, with beautiful family, uh, um, having a big company behind you. This one, that stabilizing force in all of it. Stabilizing force. All the time, I'm also happy to have this Nine of Pentacles with Magician, I told you already about it. Now, this job on Friday, it seems you will finish as a last one before you begin to feel as a King of Pentacles in here. You feel as a solid, mature person. There's maturity there as well. Now, Saturday, Night of Swords, it's energy, it, it's kind of news that you receive in here. Somebody, that's communication, that's news, that's, uh, uh, but quick exchange, you know, kind of charging. You're not happy about that. Some some offer comes your way. Somebody going to tell you, send, send you email or call you by, on the phone. There is opportunities there. But it seems you are too busy with something, thinking about something, organizing, and you don't see this as, as something worth your attention on a Saturday. Whatever this, uh, um, this um, I don't know, whatever email, telephone call, whatever this person or um, company or whatever news that you come, this offer that comes your way, you will, you will be hearing about it. You will be hearing or, as I said, getting some email or something. But um, it's not going to be. You will see, I'll, I, I, I do expect more than you offering here. Now, Sunday, I really dislike these energies. I really dislike this nine of swords with five of... with. Um, Five of um, swords. It's look. This is fear. This is nightmare. And then this is um, um, kind of sneaky energy in here. Kind of um, profiting on somebody else's misfortune. Um, um, unpleasant communication. A very unpleasant moment in here. I don't know what is happening on Sunday. They is it is it in your mind? Maybe it's just in your mind. 
you know, that you project it, because this is all big. This is all big. Look at this magician, two of cups. It's, something is big in here. All very heavy, solid energies, all promising in the uh, promises. This is powerful card with these three of, uh, of, of rods in here. Uh, your energy is in there, very solid, the big, something big comes your way. It's, it appears in this week like big. Now, on Saturday, it's like you're coming, as I said, this is a nightmare card. And in a way, I'll explain to you, give you an example. If you like, suppose to, suppose you are signing contract with somebody and then everything goes well. Now, suddenly on Sunday, you start uh, thinking, yo, what if something happened there? What if this in, this this closure in, in this contract, maybe that closure isn't good for me. Maybe it is gonna run away with my money. Maybe, maybe, you know, nothing happens. Nothing happens. It's all in your mind. You know, when you, when you dream that, you know, a, a monster is uh, chasing after you, wanna kill you, and then you just wake up in your beautiful uh, warm bed your imagination nothing's happening here all good everything is going well for you but in your mind in your mind you are kind of doubts doubts fear and doubts and it you are producing it for some reason something is is it is the reason for for these doubts maybe that what came that information that came on on a, um, on saturday this information could actually makes you bring these doubts in your mind here that you may maybe expect it a bit better offer or something, but this isn't enough for you. You want better. You want more. You think I deserve more. Not what it is. Now, maybe, and this energy of a nightmare moment is coming just because of that. But it is what it is. Otherwise, the whole week is just beautiful for you, Libra. I hope that you're going to enjoy it.